My name is Julia Valdez. I'm an assistant professor at Indiana State University in Terre Haute, Indiana. Um, I teach various courses, including Introduction to American Government. So I am looking at the Katanji Brown Jackson hearings. I'm specifically interested in how kind of rhetoric around racial kind of cues has uh, changed over time. Judicial hearings, they've had, you know, their ups and downs. They've had really sensationalized coverage. We've seen over time with like the Anita Hill hearings, how she was always questioned by a man. My question to you is, is why, why was that omitted? And how now it's kind of gone to a softer, like, we'll have a woman grill them very hard. And will you, like Justice Barrett, commit to obey all the rules of stare decisis in cases related to the issue of abortion? I'm using the C-SPAN library uh, most broadly to watch the Katanji Brown-Jackson hearings, including Sonia Sotomayor, um, including Amy Comey. Barrett, seeing how kind of the animosity has either shifted or remained the same. Terms like anti-racist, things like soft on crime, letting criminals off the hook, um, and particularly looking at how Republicans are um, using these terms, but also seeing how just the extreme contrast between how Democrats are talking about it, saying, oh, this is a historic nomination, etc. Um, and just highlighting the differences and different ways of kind of creating animosity, racial animosity, political animosity.